RefinerMD.com here out at Oak Island. We're at the point in October. Just um, my first time beach detecting. And the benefit is it's really easy to dig compared to digging in the hard clay in North Carolina where I'm from. This is uh, so far we had some pretty good experiences but I wanted to throw this other video up and show you the nice view here. Hopefully we'll come away with something but so far I see the benefits of being able to dig the cons. The bad thing about it is this is a huge area. <laughs> Where do you go? Thanks for watching. Leave any comments or any suggestions or any clubs for Oak Island, North Carolina. Most appreciated. Thanks. Hold on. I think it's more up here. Let me pinpoint it. Hold on. Yeah, it's more right there. I think we just missed it. Probably just a dime. It's more on the side, I think. Right over here. Uh -uh. I pinpointed it right there. This is an actual dig, real live dig here. There it is. It's up there now. All right, find it, man. Find it. Get in the video. Find that dime. I know they're hard to find. There you go. Oh, a penny. <laughs> that was a real find there, though. Cool. 1970. Yeah, but still. I know it don't seem like much, but to find something that deep, stick your shovel in there. How deep was that? It's over 6 to 8 inches in the beach. Wait, check. Let's see if there's something okay. right there. TreasureFinderMD.com here. Um, we didn't find much today out in the ocean, but at Oak Island. But at least one thing we do when you're metal detecting is we help clean up the environment. As you can see, all the junk we found. So, you know, that's one benefit to the community for metal de metal detectors like us or treasure finders in general. You don't even need a metal detector to clean this up. Thanks. Grandpa, hope you enjoy it. <laughs> Carpet needs to be torn up though, buddy. Sorry. There you go, okay. Say goodbye. Get you over Hurricane the evacuation route. <laughs> south point seven miles, Wilmington, 32 miles. 